What's up guys, welcome to Super Sick Media. So, you know Jack Tretton, the guy who dropped the mic last year at E3, at Sony's E3 press conference, has, if you didn't know, he has uh, left Sony Computer Entertainment America. He's the former president of Sony Computer Entertainment America. And he has talked to uh, Games Industry International and he told them that the reason he left Sony at the time he did was because he wanted to go out on top, leave with a bang, and become platform agnostic. He said that he's been able to focus on other forms of entertainment that he hasn't been able to focus on and not be tied to a specific box or making a specific brand popular. And he, recently, he has joined the advisory board for a new company called Genitar, which researches artificial intelligence intelligence and human computer interfaces. He's also going to be hosting Spike's E3 coverage this year, which is pretty interesting, which he also states that he sees himself in a more free agent role and really trying to branch out and smell the fresh air of being able to be platform agnostic and not just be dedicate, dedicated excuse me, to console gaming. So he really wants to do different things, kind of kind of like, um, what's, what's his name? uh john carmack john carmack he he kind of wanted to do different things other than you know work at id software and make the same games over and over again he wanted to do virtual reality with oculus and that's exactly what he did he moved over there and he became a lead in on the project so that's kind of what jack trends do he wants to do different things and he left this is what a lot of people in every interest industry want to do they want to leave while they're on top before things start to fall apart he felt like he helped make this this very successful he redeemed the financial woes that occurred during the launch of the playstation 3 with the launch of the playstation 4 playstation division of sony is making unprecedented profits you know profits they haven't seen in years since probably like the ps2 era and you know he just wanted to go so you no know, you can kind of respect his uh, decision on that front but what's i find it really interesting is that he's going to be hosting uh spikes e3 coverage and He's going to probably be commentating on the Sony press conference, the Microsoft press conference, and Nintendo stream press conference, and the, th and the third party press conferences. And he's not going to be tied or obligated to a specific company so he can say what he really feels about each thing. Although I, I, I think he really does like PlayStation and all that, but he doesn't have to, I don't know, you know... Uh, kiss up or you know when, when you work for a, a company or something you, you can't just talk bad about the company you work for it's just it's not professional and you know usually in the contract it states that you can't do things like that anyway so this is an interesting bit of news if you like the video if you're informed at all don't forget to hit that like button comment in the comment section down below i want to know what you think about this how do you feel about him hosting spikes e3 coverage how do you feel about him leaving sony do you respect his decision decision also subscribe if you haven't already follow me on twitter so i can keep you up to date with my videos and gaming news as always guys link to the article will be in the description stay super and i'll see you guys in the next video bye